Hello friends and welcome to Ticker TV's Commodities Market Update. I am Jatin Trivedi. I am a senior research analyst with LKV for Commodities. Uh, so uh, this week, you know, the prices have you know shooted up uh, on the gold and silver front, where the gold prices have you know crossed the important hurdle of 49,000 on the MCX recently, and uh, on the COMEX also it has been trading above around 1850. So this is an important uh, phase for gold and silver both as the prices you know can take a new uh, trend on the upside as the levels are looking quite positive right now till the time the gold prices are holding 1845 on closing basis and on the sil- on in the comex and on the silver front also till the time they are closing above 2350 on the comex the outlook remains very much on the positive side for gold and silver both now if we talk about talk about it on the mcx front then the gold prices need to keep on closing above 49000 until the time it is doing so uh, the levels which are the next resistance point for gold prices are at 50000 and 51000 respectively uh, 50000 is just a psychological number friends so one should not be you know aiming at 50000 as their uh, modest target but look to aim for 51000 as the prices are looking quite positive on the gold market so now uh, the question remains that uh, if in all the geopolitical tension you know eases off between russia and ukraine then uh, how do gold prices react so uh, the gold prices are reacting to uh, numerous uh, updates uh, first and foremost is the federal reserve's upcoming interest rate hike in the march month uh, then uh, the geopolitical tension which is a positive signal for gold and silver both the federal reserve rate hike is a negative aspect but if and all the federal reserve does not hike it by 50 basis point and just hikes a nominal 25 basis point then gold and silver will show a good amount of bullish run again uh, so that is again a positive sign for gold and silver uh, the next leg of positive sign for gold and silver is the you know weakening rupee uh, which has you know uh, started closing up, uh, below 75 recently uh, against the dollar so if and all the prices you know keep on falling onto the rupee front then again uh, the gold and silver uh, as an importer of uh, gold and silver the indian price on the mcx will keep on scaling higher so this is again the third factor which is going to impact the gold and silver prices on the positive front so only the aspect remains on the negative front for immediate to near term is uh, any positive update towards the uh, russia ukraine uh, you know uh, war situation uh, which does not and should not escalate at a point uh, that will be a knee jerk reaction where the gold and silver prices will start falling but uh, again it will start taking support so uh, uh let's just uh, you, know, you know say if the uh, if and all the situation arises where uh, there is some amount of you know uh, a, a battle between us uh, uh, russia and ukraine then definitely the gold and silver prices will strongly escalate at a very a sharp rise and uh, that sharp spike will come with respect to 50 to 100 dollars in the gold prices and on the mcx front a couple of thousand point easily you will be seeing on to the gold prices so whenever there is some geopolitical you know war like situation between two nations uh, you know we, uh, including one with a very big nation like russia uh, the other nation also starts to you know uh, uh, try to uh, calm the situation down or you know take some advantage of it uh, into their trade positions so this issue might not you know settle down very easily but uh, definitely we will see some you know volatility also into the market so Uh, in in all these scenarios gold prices will try to factor in all the positives which it can so uh, better to keep your positions hedged uh, if you are having any positions into equities then it is a good time to you know keep uh, allocation into the gold prices as well as the prices look very positive so this is about it from me guys on the commodities market front for this week with ticker tv this is jatin trivedi signing off